Hey everybody, this is the small wood stove in my living room. Uh, it features both front and top loading. Um, I just started just a very small fire in there a couple of minutes ago. And what's kind of interesting is uh, this is a glass front, so a little more heat comes through the glass. But uh, the cast iron of the stove, I actually did start the fire more on the left side of the stove than center or right, and you can actually see that. So the cast iron, that's going to take a couple of minutes to warm up. There are some little side shelves on here which are still uh, pretty much room temperature. Those are nice. You can set things there without them getting too crazy hot. But the actual stovepipe itself is the first thing that really heats up. And if we look up here, that goes all the way up through my cathedral ceiling. There's actually a sheet metal box around it which stays uh, relatively cold. And unfortunately when a fire is going, or, or when a fire is not going, that's really, really, really cold. It's not insulated and it's sucking the heat out of my house. So I started this fire right now so that in a little bit I can go up into my attic and take a look around that sheet metal box because um, above that it's actually a double wall stainless steel insulated chimney pipe. So I should be able to add some insulation around there and keep that box up there from sucking the heat out of my house. Also interesting, is this wood stove is about oh a foot and a half from the wall. There's the wall, and it has a sheet metal heat guard on the back. Uh, it's just a piece of sheet metal, nothing too fancy, and it looks like it's actually doing a pretty good job. Um, the radiant heat really does not come off the back of the stove at all. Again, here's kind of a neat view of uh, the side of the stove, and then also that uh, cast iron little uh, shelf on the side of it. So that's it. That's a thermal video of my parlor wood stove.